Hey, thanks for tuning in. Today I have a quick unboxing video for you. I was able to pick up a few pieces from the recent Louis Vuitton menswear collection. It's the Cloud collection. I am super duper excited about these pieces. I actually have one more piece that was ordered but it's still not here yet. I figured uh, it's better to show you the pieces that I do have and kind of like the last Dior collection I'll just share the last piece when it finally gets to me but I'm super super excited about these pieces so I'm going to jump right into it so these are pieces from the men's I think it's their fall winter collection uh, it was the cloud collection so it's all this blue base with these clouds that spell out the LV monogram. It's super adorable. I know it's also pretty popular on like social media. It, was, it had quite a stir when it first was revealed. My boyfriend and I were pretty sad that we couldn't grab anything from the LV Squared collection, which is the collaboration with Nigo. And so uh, we also didn't have much expectation on being able to get our hands on some of the cloud pieces, but lo and behold, that was a little bit different this time around. So we are super stoked about that. I will go ahead and share the first piece. It came in uh, this cute little bag right here. Every time I look at the LV bags though, it's the color. It's like LV, Hermes, and Fendi all are like, I know the shades are all definitely different and Fendi is definitely more yellow than it is orange but when LV changed to this color I was like very confused why they did that anyway but the first piece is in this little box right here how cute let me open up the drawer and you see there's the little dust bag and inside there is ta-da it is the pocket organizer and in, of course, the cloud print for this season. I do like how on the inside, the menswear collections, it says Louis Vuitton Paris, made in France. It says autumn winter 2020. So I like that it has reference to what collection it's from so that it's a lot easier to remember. And I'm pretty impressed with how many card slots this little pocket organizer has. So there's a slot in the back it's like a V cut as well. And then there are three slots on the left flap. And then there are three slots at the top of the right flap. And then there's another like V pocket at the bottom of the right flap. So you can fit a good number of cards in here. As soon as we saw it, we were like, oh, it actually kind of reminds us of the Goyard card case. Goyard one is a little bit smaller, I believe, than this. It's more a straight uh, card size, or maybe it's the same and just the, my boyfriend's one was so beat up by the time I ever saw it that it was looked smaller, it's possible. Uh, but it kind of reminds us of that. It's like a similar folded flap layout. But yeah, it's super, super cute. Uh, loving the little print on it. This is the first LV printed piece that we have, so I'm curious to see how the wear and tear goes. I know on the illustration series, like the, the Christmas illustrations that come out every year, people have mentioned that the, the printing on it will wear off over time. So I would expect that to happen on this piece, but I'm curious to see how long it takes before some of that happens. So I'll definitely keep you guys all posted on how that goes. But yeah, this is the first piece, the little pocket organizer. We're really excited to have this because one of the pieces we really wanted from the Nigo collection was the little duck pocket organizer and we were not able to get our hands on that. So we're at least excited to have the cloud piece in our collection. Okay, and the next item is also super exciting. It came in this massive box over here and this is the, definitely the largest Louis Vuitton box I have ever received. I, <laughs> some of you might already know what it is based on the size of this box but uh, I definitely was not expecting this item to come in this kind of box so let me go ahead and share what it is. All right so it's in its 
oh, it's in its dust bag here. Let me try to, oh, all right. The other piece is actually the keep all from the same cloud collection. We are super stoked about this one. We really did not expect to be able to get this piece, but here it is in our collection now. As you can see, there's the wonderful cloud LV monogram in the front with a gradation. So from a darker blue to a lighter blue, the handles are in that same cobalt blue. The strap is also in that same blue leather which is really gorgeous actually. The key ball itself is actually really soft. It's a lot softer than I expected it to be. It might be because of how the color dye had to go through and how all of it was treated that it came out a little bit softer than the regular key balls, but I feel like as you can see, like it's really squishy. Not to suggest, like I don't have a regular monogram key ball, so I can't really compare it directly, but when I lift it and handle it in the store, it feels like the canvas is a little bit stiffer, if you will. And I, it, like, the, I just didn't expect this to be as soft. And we, we shared that with our uh, essay when we were picking it up as well. We were like, oh, it's like really soft. And they were like, yeah, isn't it super soft? So I think um, it is a bit on the softer side, which is gorgeous to the touch and might be slightly questionable in terms of how much it keeps its structure but then again it's just like a duffel bag anyway so what structure does it really need to have you know oh this piece has silver hardware it has the zippers the two zippers that open it up it just has a whole bunch of packing air inside to keep the shape the straps in there I promise <laughs> but it is a super super cute piece it's super super lightweight and uh, it's just so, <laughs> we're just super, super excited about it. It's a very loud piece. It's definitely like a statement piece. And I uh, fully expect my boyfriend to use this for travel. And, and of course, like we have it and I, I'd want to use it for travel. Uh, it's just a little bit on the loud side for me personally, <laughs> but it's a gorgeous design. And it's definitely like a collector's piece. I don't know. It's just really pretty though. So I will enjoy using it as well as admiring it. The reason why I was surprised about this box is because I know the LV Speedies and a lot of the Louis Vuitton bags, they'll come folded because it's canvas and they're all lightweight. Like the Speedies come folded instead of being you know, fully stuffed in the Speedy form. So I thought the key ball would also be folded and in a smaller box, like at least like a thinner box so that, you know, because they fold the speedies, why wouldn't they fold the key balls? But um, I don't know if it's because it's part of this kind of collection and it's a more special piece rather than their classic line. So if you have a key ball, let me know in the comments down below if you also gotten this kind of massive box to bring it home in <laughs> um, because that was just a big surprise for me. Let me back up just a little bit. So there's a little bit of a story as to how we were able to order these pieces. Um, went back when the Nigo collection dropped in July, I want to say, the pieces that we really wanted were the key ball from the Nigo collection, the pocket organizer with the duck, and like a couple of other things that by the time we were able to try and order, everything was pretty much sold out. All the things that we wanted were pretty much sold out. So we were a little bummed, but we were like, okay, I mean, that's what it is, it's fine. And then uh, in August, that's when the cloud collection dropped, but our SA reached out saying, hey, they're taking pre-orders. Were there specific things that we wanted to get? And so we looked through the lookbook and we, I, you know, we said the key ball, the pocket organizer, and the last thing that's still on its way to us. And how it works is they will place the pre-orders for you the first day that it opens. And uh, you have to pay for all of those items. They'll, they'll put it in the system. And as the system processes and then ships out the pieces, you get confirmed for the piece. If they don't have the piece for you by the time they fully process your order, 
and ship the pieces out, then you'll get refunded for the item that they no longer have. And if you receive the piece and you don't like it for whatever reason, you can always return it. So that's how Louis Vuitton's pre-order process works. But we're really thankful for our SA who uh, worked with us to be able to place our order as soon as the orders opened. They have been very slowly trickling in since the orders were placed. I think the orders were placed like the end of July. And then he's like, oh, they should be coming in the next few weeks or so. We picked these up a couple weeks ago. We've had them for a couple weeks. So these two are ready and here. And then our last piece, we're just like, hey, where is it? Nobody knows. I think they're working through the production and you know shipping out all of those pieces. So that piece is still on its way. But that's a little story of how we picked up some of these pieces and we're super excited about this. We have a little trip coming up, so I'm excited to use this piece. It's a road trip, so it'll be easier for, for us to like manage and control, you know, it's not like getting thrown around all over the place. It's not like we're running through an airport with it, so I feel like it's a little less loud <laughs> to be out there with it. Uh, but we will be using this and that'll probably be our little test drive of this luggage piece But we're super super stoked to have it. It is such a beautiful color I feel like it's translating really pretty on camera as well, which is really nice because sometimes the pieces don't translate as beautifully on camera, but These are the new Louis Vuitton pieces that we have added to our collection so these are the new pieces that we've recently added to our Louis Vuitton collection. I keep saying our because my boyfriend and I use a lot of the pieces together. Uh, any kind of piece, whether it's clothing, bags, or I guess in this case luggage or small leather goods, whatever we can share or whatever we can use together, we will use together, accessories included. There are some things like pierced earrings and shoes that just don't make sense, but you get what I mean. We we do use uh, a lot of the pieces together, so that's why I keep saying it's our collection. What are your thoughts on the Louis Vuitton Cloud Collection? Did you pick up anything from this collection? Uh, you know, do you feel like it's too not classic? You know, it's a little too out there for you? Or what do you think? Do you like this colorway? Let me know your thoughts about this collection down below. If you have any questions on any of these pieces or really anything at all, feel free to leave them down below or head on over to Instagram. I'd be happy to help however I can. If you like this video and you like unboxing videos, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate your feedback and support. Don't forget that there is a giveaway that's still open right now on my channel. I will link that video above and in the description box down below. So definitely head over there and check it out for all the rules and, and process and all of that. But that's really meant as a huge thank you to all of you who have subscribed to my channel and joined this community. I am blown away every day by all of the people who tune in and um, you know continue the conversation in the comments down below and all of that good stuff. So I really, really enjoy having this kind of open conversation with all of you and I hope to continue doing that in the future. But if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I post new fashion related videos every Sunday and Wednesday. So until next time, bye!